Good evening, everybody. It is Monday night. It is April the 13th. I hope everybody's doing okay. Had a good weekend and everything. Uh, finding a way to pass the time, figuring out your uh, grocery situations and money situations, unemployment, if you're working on that. I know I've been working on that myself, um, but I will get there. I hope everybody's got some success in those things and uh, just can hunker down here a little bit longer, show some grit. And let's do this. Um, so I'm coming to you here from Lake Orion, Michigan, in the mitten, about right there. Um, about a half hour away, 35 minutes away from the Motor D, down the road, down 75. Let's get to this. It's time for some trivia. I'm going to ask you five trivia questions. Then I'm going to go back through and I'm going to get read those questions again. And then at that point, I will give you the answers for those questions. All right, so, uh, and please, always feel free to um, comment on how you did and everything. Please just don't comment on Facebook or YouTube um, anything to do with the answers or the questions, because then it spoils it if anybody, you know, anybody else reads that that, won't, that was going to play. Okay, fine. Let's do this. Here's your first of your five questions. The first one is a fast food question, and it is. Which fast food chain offers the Big Buford? Again, which fast food chain offers the Big Buford? Question number two. Which one of these four companies does not belong? Remember that song, one of these things is not like the others. Which one of these four does not belong? Fender, Gibson, Yamaha, or Brinkman? Again, Fender, Gibson, Yamaha, or Brinkman? Which one of those does not belong with the others? Question number three. On which reality TV show, and it's, it's kind of a reality TV show, do Sal, Mir, Mer, Joe, and Q compete to embarrass each other? Again, on which reality TV show do Sal, Mir, Mer, I can't keep not saying it right, Mer, as in Murray, Sal, Mer, Joe, and Q compete to embarrass each other. On which TV show do Sal, Mer, Joe, and Q compete to embarrass each other? Question number four. What is a word that represents the sound it makes called? For example, words like boom or crack or meow or crash. Those words that the word that represents the sound it makes. In other words, the word sounds like the thing it's describing. What kind of word is that? Question number five. Who played Wonder Woman in the 2017 movie Wonder Woman? Who played the title character in the 2017 movie Wonder Woman? All right, let's go back through. Now's a good time to pause this video. That way you can get your answers straight if you're playing along at home. And uh, I'm going to go back through them here now and give you the answers. Here we go. Your first question was, which fast food chain offers a menu item called the Big Buford? Uh, you could actually have answered two things for this. Um, it is checkers slash rallies. I've looked it up, and it, they were it's actually offered at both of them. I knew that it was at Checkers. There used to be a Checkers right down the road from me here in Lake Orion. It's closed. It went out. It's gone. It's been gone for a while. It's not a it's not a uh, shutdown situation. It, it went out before that. But um, anyway, Checkers and Rallies offer the Big Buford. Question number two: Which one of these four does not belong? Fender, Gibson, Yamaha, or Brinkman? Correct answer is Brinkman. Fender, Gibson, and Yamaha all make musical instruments. Brinkman makes gas grills, like barbecues. Question number three. On which reality-type TV show do Sal, Mer, Joe, and Q compete to embarrass each other? The correct answer. It's a show on True TV called Impractical Jokers. I love this show. It's a, it's a great show. It's fun. If you don't watch it, I highly suggest it. Impractical Jokers. Question number four. What is a word that represents the sound that it makes? What is that called? Examples would be boom or crack 
or meow or crash? The correct answer is onomatopoeia. Onomatopoeia is the correct answer. Onomatopoeia words are words that sound, the word itself sounds like the thing it's trying to describe. In question number five, who played Wonder Woman in the 2017 Wonder Woman? The correct answer, that was Gal Gadot, G-A-D-O-T. Gal Gadot played Wonder Woman in the movie Wonder Woman in 2017. Those are your five trivia questions tonight for April the, 7th, the 13th. It's Monday night. Like I said, uh, please always be sure to like these videos on Facebook and definitely share them. Uh, share them with whoever you'd like. Pop them on your own Facebooks or whatever. And also, uh, if you want to subscribe to my YouTube channel, that way you will get um, notification as soon as I post a video. I post these at about 7 o'clock um, Michigan time. And uh, that's so you'll get a, like a little email that just says, Matt Schwark has posted a video. And uh, so be sure to subscribe as well. And uh, subscribe just under my name, Matt Schwark, S-C-H-W-A-R-C to the K. All right, I will see you tomorrow on April 14th. That'll be a Tuesday, but right now it is Monday, the 13th. Until I see you next time, be safe, be nice, hunker down, flatten the curve. Go Lions. See you tomorrow.